Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are looking at the combos for the Rocket Tenpai uh, deck that I showed off on my channel a couple days ago. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. So this is a combo with Pydra and any discard. So we start by normaling the Pydra. Pydra effect to grab Kaiman. We activate Kaiman, grabbing Chandra. We effect of Chandra to special itself. And then from here, we can start doing our link play. So we link Chandra into Striker. Striker effect gets to grab the boot. Um, and then we link Pydra and Striker off into Romulus. Romulus effect to add the Dragon's Ravine. We'll then activate the Dragon's Ravine effect, pitching the uh, discard in our hand. Um, we get to dump Abso out of Dragon. Abso effect gets to add us a Tracer. Then we'll sack off the Ravine for Boot. Boot effect special Tracer. Tracer effect pop the boot to special the Recharger. And then from here, we will link off the Recharger into a Pisty. Then we'll link off the Tracer and the Romulus into a Triple Burst. And then from here, we can Pisty back uh, any level four dragon. Uh, it does have to be a Dark because we are Dark Block from Tracer into Rocket Recharger. And then from here, you'll just link off all five into Borland. Uh, this is a great play if you've got uh, D-Barriered or if you've got Threatening Roared uh, in the battle phase. It just gives you a nice backup plan. Uh, so let's go ahead and get on to the second combo. Uh, so here's the second combo. We have a copy of Pydra and yet again another discard. Um, so this is going to be very much the same. We're going to see uh, Pydra grab Kaiman, activate Kaiman, grab Chandra, special to Chandra. Um, and then we go here and do Striker. Striker effect grab Boot. And then we can go into Romulus, grab Ravine. Dra uh, then we activate Dragon's Ravine, pitching the uh, discard in our hand. This time it's Nibiru. Dump the Abso. Abso effect adds the Tracer. We will activate Boot. Boot effect special Tracer. Tracer effect pop the Boot to summon Recharger. Now again, this is exactly the same line. This is just where it diverges, is if you were forced to go first in the first game. So if you're blind going first playing this deck, you have to assume your opponent's on Tenpai. So we just go ahead and link everything off into a Scareclaw Tryheart. Now Tryheart is a really powerful card. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't have the protection that we'd like it to have, but we can't really do anything about that. Essentially what this forces them to do is make link plays instead of synchro plays because they can't attack with any of their synchro monsters, so there's no point. But they have to make link plays and the link plays are not protected by the field spell. So that's the concept behind the Tryheart. So let's get into the last combo for today. Uh, so this is just the generic OTK with Tenpai. If you're interested in how Tenpai plays, here's a great example. So we start by activating the Field Spell. The Field Spell effect is to add any Tenpai monster, but then we have to discard a card. So we'll discard this Ash Blossom and Joy Spring that we don't need uh, when we're going for the OTK. So we uh, Noble Summon the Pydra. Pydra effect, uh, this is in main phase by the way, uh, grabs Kaiman. Uh, Stop me if you've seen this one before, but this time we're going into battle phase. Here we'll attack with the Pydra, and then on attack declaration, we Kaiman to add and then summon, because we're in battle phase, we can do both, the Chandra. On attack uh, in damage step, we Chandra effect to special out a card. We special out the Fodra, and this is the board state you really want to be in uh, in order to do the best OTK, that is Field Spell and all three monsters. So we just go ahead and attack with the other three monsters. Um, while you have Pydra on the field, you take no battle damage from your Tenpais, uh, your Fire Dragons, I should say. And while you have Fodra on the field, your Fire Dragons cannot be destroyed by battle. So you're pretty safe to attack into pretty much anything. So then now here we activate Chandra Effect. Now this is important. You want to do Chandra Effect first, um, not to attack, but to Synchro with itself and Fodra. Uh, so you're going to Synchro into the Bident. From here, you can activate Biden's effect to reborn the Fadra. And then because Fadra was special summoned, you can activate its effect to reborn the Chandra. Um, so here you're pretty good. You can attack with the uh, Biden, with the Chandra and the Fadra. And if your opponent is not dead already, then what you can do is you can activate the Fadra effect to sync with itself and the Biden for the Transcendent. Um, from here, you can activate the Bidens once per duel effect to special itself back. And then from here, depending on whether or not you have the budget deck or not, you will activate Bident Dragon. So if you're playing the budget build like I have been, you'll Bident to pop the field spell here and use its effect, use the field spell's effect to increase Transcendent's attack down up to th uh, 6k. So you'll attack with Transcendent and you'll attack with Bident. 
And then if your opponent's not already dead, you can go Pydra with the Bident into another Synchro 10, which for the budget build is Ruddy Rose, which does get you an extra uh, 32 and gets rid of the entire graveyard. Um, if for some reason your opponent's not already dead. Um, but if you are not playing the budget build and you can afford the Trident Dragon, the way this line differs is instead of using the Biden to pop the field spell, you'll not use that effect and instead use the Trident to pop the field spell and the leftover Tenpai Dragon, which will boost this up to 6,000, just like Transcendent, but it'll have three attacks. So you'll get to do it a full 18,000 damage off of just this Trident Dragon alone. And that is the OTK. So those are the, the combos for this deck. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're interested in the deck. Make sure to check out the deck profile. Um, but that is all for me. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.